Yes then guys, how are you doing? My name's Morsi and welcome back to my channel. At the time of recording this video, we have had three Silver Star objectives. We've got Enteca, Sulemana and Skov Olsen, three absolute ballers. EA is starting off with a bang. And I've had a couple of requests to be able to fit them all into one team. So that's what I've gone and done, guys. So this is the team that I managed to come up with, guys. I am calling it the best silver team in FIFA 22 right now. We've got four silver informs in one damn team. The silver star boys, we've got Skov Olsen, Enteca, Sulemana, And we've also got a just a generic silver team of the week card. Asan Cisse, the Gambian beast. So let's quickly run through the team, guys. In goal, we are starting off in the Swiss League, and we've got Heinz Linder. 750 coins, 6 for 2. Austrian goalkeeper playing for Basel. It looks all right. <laughs> Our two centre-backs staying in the Swiss League, both of them playing for FC Basel as well. we got Andy Palmard and Ire Cormet. 1.2k and 950 coins. Not the tallest of boys at the back. 6 foot and 5 foot 11, but some very nice stats on the two of them. They've both got pace. That's a big tick. Pretty decent dribbling stats for Silver centre-back. And defensively and physically, they are both pretty damn solid. Overall, two very, very cheap and... Saucy centre halves. At right back, offering that link into Silver Star Scovy Boy Olsen, we got Kevin Malqui. Had a gold card last year that's pretty decent. Uh, got a lot of use to be fair. I'm pretty soon had an inform potentially. I remember Kirk against this guy quite a bit. He's been dropped down to a silver. He's lost the pace. He's been absolutely butchered, but defensively he looks super solid. But that pace, man. What have they done to my man? So he is here to get chemistry to Andreas Scott Olsen, the second silver star this year, and probably my favourite. I'm not going to lie, guys, this man has that little something in game. It's the left foot finesse shot. He's built like a beast. He has a big dump truck. Basically, once he gets going, no defender is tackling this man, and that finesse shot trait is ridiculous. At left back, we've got Gideon Mensa, 4.4k purely for the fact he gets a strong link into Sulemana. Uh, his price may drop a little bit, uh, over the next couple of weeks, I hope it does, guys. He is kind of fading away. He was in that 10k price range. You can now get him for the likes of 5k. I got lucky on a 59th minute snipe. And of course, the strong link into Sulemana to get this man on 10 chemistry is all we need. Four star, four star, the first silver star of FIFA 22. Absolute beast. Honestly, no, I've literally not used the card apart from the most recent Diata. It feels as quick and as agile on the ball as this chap. I was subbing him on in foot champions, guys, and he was getting goals. He's that good. So the last chap in the Swiss League, we got Asan Cisse. Super difficult to link in, guys. The only real way of doing it is uh, if you want to get the rest of the boys in, is he's utilising this little back trio here from the Swiss League. But Cisse comes in on 8 chem, 26k he costs me, still around that price. you got to pay a premium for silver informs, guys. 6 for 2, only 2 star, 2 star. But don't be phased. The man is an absolute baller. He's got decent physical stats, fantastic shooting stats. His left foot is a cannon. He's got the pace, he's got the height, the presence in the air. He's an absolute beast. So last but not least, we have got the trio up top. The French lads repping it in the Ligue 1 and the Spanish League. Obviously, Enteca, guys, is the most recent silver star. If you've not got him, go out and get him. Trust me, just go and do it. I played four games with this chap. He got four goals and one assist as a striker. However, we're going to be playing him as a centre mid in this video. Just look at the state of this guy's card. We're a chem star that increases the defending. We pretty much go into Hullet Gang territory. I've got Hunter on him because I played him as a striker in the player view that I used him for. But guys, trust me. You need this guy. If you've not got him, go out and get him right now. Now our two bruises in the midfield. We've got Junior, Dina, Ibembe, PSG, 5'9", 3 star, 3 star, 3.3k he cost me. He's basically got the pace and decent stamina and uh, strength. That's pretty much it. He's going to play as that out and out CDM, sweeping up, hopefully utilising the pace and alongside it. This man is crazy. Look at the state of this card. We've got Cypriot, 5.9k. He's a little bit more on the expensive side, this chap. 4 star skills as well. Happy days. As well-rounded as it gets. Basically 70 to mid-70s across the whole damn card. He's going to play as that box-to-box -box center mid. Utilizing the pace, the decent going forward stats, the nice passing. He is one of the most well-rounded silvers I've seen. And that is probably why he uh, is a little bit on the pricey side. He even goes up to 9k, guys. I can't believe it. I got super lucky picking mine up for uh, about 5.9, didn't I? Custom tactics were pretty much balanced across the board. We got fast build up for a bit of a laugh. I'm playing Silver Lounge. I want to get goals quickly. Uh, 55 on the whip, four players in the box, two corners, one free kick. So formation is a 4 1 2 1 2. Olsen and Cissé are my two strikers. Sulemana is pulling the strings in the pocket. And Teka, Cyprian are the two centre mids. And Dina Ibembe sitting in that CDM role. And the bat four stays the same. So, guys, what are your first impression of the boys? Do you think it looks good? Good. I'm going to show you just how good it is. We're going to go into Silver Lounge and we're going to win every damn game we play. 
So game number one with the silver boys, what are we saying? 47 chemistry. But he's got Skov Olsen, he's got Nilsson, the six foot six Swedish beast. Absolute ball. Look at the size of this man. Look at his legs. But let's start off strong. As I said, I am not losing a single game, guys. We're here for the W's. I'm still working towards the life of friendly um, objective. I think I'm close to the 100 wins now. I've been grinding Silver Lounge, boys. Trust me, it's pretty much all I play at the moment. Oh, dear. Not quite the ideal start, is it? I don't know what I was doing defensively, guys. I'm not playing a couple of days. All right, let me off. We'll come back. Don't you worry. And Tekka, absolute unit. Come on now, boys. This front three are dangerous. One more to Cissé. Cross goal. Have a bit of that in the top corner then, lads. Trust me. The left foot. Both my strikers are left footed. Cissé and Skov Olsen. Absolute rocket. Cissé on the overlap. We're on side, I think. We're on side. Cross the goalkeeper in the back of the net. Just like that, we, <laughs> we go 1-0 down. Asan Cissé. Nah, mate. Oh, sit him down. Skov, Skovy boy also. I want Cissé at the back post. Gets the hat trick. What is that? Like a four minute hat trick for the boy. We go 1 0 down, lads. Turn it around just like that. What did I say? We're not losing a single game. Skov, little ding. Cissé! Questionable goalkeeping. But on his weak foot, the two star weak foot, he makes it four. We're playing sailing. 4 2. Okay, I'll let him off. Nilsson gets the goal. It's definitely not the last goal we're going to see in this game. Man. Go on, Cissé. Make it, lad. Keeper's coming. Long dink. Let's go. Is that his fifth? I think the man has scored five goals. I don't know why he's doing like the Canio S chip there, but we will take it. What was I saying about this man? This is Randy Enteke at his finest. Play him as that centre mid. Just ping shots, guys. Finesse shots, power strikes, whatever you want to do. The man bags goals for fun. What is going on? What is going on? Scobby boy saw Enteke do it and he thought, why not step up to the plate? That one's questionably better. I've literally taken one touch, smashed it top ends. Unreal seats. Dodging the tackles. Oh, it's a penalty. My opponent's lost his head. There's slide tackles all over the place. Can we make this eight and round off this W? Randy and Tekka's going to step up here. Uh, that's Cyprian last. There we go. Top left corner. The top is to the top. Right there. For the boys. Oh, it's a beautiful penalty. You don't get much better than that. Top bin, side net in, 8-2. It's pretty much pretty much game over. Oh, that's a beautiful play. Oh, it's a beautiful goal. First time finish. We'll make it nine. See how many we can get. If we get double digits in game number one. All right, my opponent's team's questionable. He's pretty much uh, giving up in all hope. Uh, but if we can make it ten, that'd be beauty. Scobby boy Olsen. Scob Olsen! Get it there, boy! <laughs> if we make it ten... For the boys. That is the most ridiculous tackle I have ever seen. Hold up. He's just got a red card. But what was that slide tackle, boys? So a 10-2 win in game number one. What are we saying up next? At least there's 100 chemistry. Scott Olsen, a full Serie team. I'm pretty certain that's Dalbert. If you remember his Samba star from last year. Oh, it's poor bit defending from Gideon. Keeper, well done. Do we have a game in our hand? It might be a little less open than the 10-2 game that you saw last time. Randy can lead that charge. The man as a centre midfielder hangs with the best. Through the middle. Oh, he's at the bar. Who was that? Bit of Dino action. Oh, the press is beautiful. Cissé, use that pace up against Damian. That Amian is a unit. I've used him before. I'm scared of him. Recycle. Malqui on the overlap. Little one inside. Cissé again. Beautiful bit of play from the boys. Lovely touch. Couldn't pick out Scov in the middle though. Oh, Randy. Big Randy. It's beautiful to see. Counter attack, Scov. Drive it home, lad. Drive it home. Look at Cissé arriving. Is this Gary Medal pulling the strings? 
the chili boy. Anyone remember his old Miss Green card from a couple of years ago? What a baller. By the way, we better get a Halloween promo this year. It's one of my favourite things of the year. Old Miss Green rule breakers, whatever it's called. Just as long as it happens, I'm happy. Oh, Randy. Randy! What a save. Providal. The Italian boy comes back to haunt me. I raved about him in a squad build I did a while back. He's a good goalkeeper. Come on, Dina. Oh, Dina, that is a lovely bit of play. Cisse, there it is. Always clinical in front of goal, guys. This Dina in Pembe is class, by the way. The pace, the, like, the strength that he's got. Nipping at the toes of my opponent, winning the ball back into the Gambian beast. And he's not messing about. Yes. Suleimana gets the goal. Trying to get better at fake shotting inside the box, guys. I struggled a little bit at the start of the year, but I was slowly getting the hang of it. But we get the 2-0 lead, and Alan the Ape, Crouch Potato FC. We'll catch you later, mate. Third game with the boys. 42. What is with people with 42 chemistry? Guys, silver teams are affordable. All right? You don't have to go and buy the most meta cards like I'm using in this one. At least put 100 chem together, lads. Cissé! Cissé! There it is. Second time's the charm. The man gets another goal. And that is a lovely rage quit. One no rage quit. We take those. Another win to the objective. Let's get on to another one. Game number four then. 100 chemistry, a full Premier League silver team. Some quality cards in there. Twanzebi, Dennis, Tabo. We may have a game in our hands. Mate, this core mayor at the back, by the way. Both centre backs have been insanely solid for me so far. Really good at pressing the ball. I've not noticed the height letting down, especially against the six for six boys. Ah, oh, Camaldina, lucky. Yes, Palmar, well done. Come on now, boys. 22 mins in. We're yet to really have a proper chance here. Um, my opponent's a decent player. We've got a decent game on our hands, but I feel like we got this one. Come on now, CC. Malkui bombing forward. This man is loving it. In the middle, Skov. Not quite. All right, boys, from the corner, like a salmon. It's got to be. It's got to be. It's off the bar. The rebound, please. Please, boys, what is going on? Scoff, it's got to be, boys. The green time for Ness shot. He finds the back of the net. Malqui, by the way, at right back is impressing me a lot. He feels so damn good on the ball. He's up and down the pitch. He feels a lot stronger than what his, uh, his card stats are telling me. And that's another rage quit. Can we make it five for five? Five wins, five games. Let's see. Silver Lounge is popping tonight. I'm literally searching and I'm buying a game straight away. 47 chemistry again. Why is it always 47 chemistry? So it's every time it's like in that 40 to 47. Are we inside? We are. One nil to the boys. So there we have it guys. Five games and five wins with these boys. An absolutely incredible silver team. 100% the best silver team I have currently got on FIFA 22. Been able to fit four informs in here. 100 chemistry. We get all the silver stars involved. It's a dream. And these two French boys are fantastic holding down the midfield. Cissé in front of goal. I think he scored five in the first game. His quality. Suleimana. Don't need to go into detail. And Tekka and uh, Skov Olsen. Left foot cannons. Malqui really impressed me. This whole defence did, to be fair. Both the centre backs, not really incredible stat wise, not too like, super tall, 5'11 and 6 foot. Really damn solid. And Malqui, he must have a hidden in game boost because he felt incredible on the ball. Really solid defensively. Gideon Mensa, as always, super solid. And in goal, Linda. What's he got? Comes cautious with crosses and solid player. He was a decent keeper. Anyway, guys, if you did enjoy, please drop me a like on the video. Leave me a comment. Let me know your favourite silver card at the moment in FIFA 22. I'll catch you very soon for another one. Take it easy.